This video is going to show you how to create a cash payment journal posting to an existing creditor account in Ledger Entry. The function Ledger Entry LEN, is used to enter the details of the cash payment journal and post the transactions to the financials. Included in VAS Circular 200 reporting package is the document payment voucher. Cash payment vouchers can be printed from journals posted to held or posted depending on your organization's policy. In this course, we will be printing the document from posted journals, so we'll do the post action in this lesson. For existing creditors, the cash payment voucher document displays the address information from master data, addresses ADD, maintained in the system for the creditor in the debit line. If you fill the information in the VAT and cash voucher group, the cash payment voucher document will prioritize displaying this information instead of from the master data. To follow instructions in this video, make sure that the function ledger entry and the post action are not restricted from you. It is assumed that the static details used in this example such as the journal type, account code, analysis codes as well as entry form already exist in the system. In the action box, type LEN and then press enter. Enter the business unit code, for example VAS, to post the journal to, then click OK. In the field labeled enter journal type, type CP then press enter. Select the form all underscore VAS then click OK. The ledger entry form is displayed. In the field labeled Transaction Reference, enter the reference for the journal. In this example, we enter CP 2112005, then press Enter. Now, let's enter the details for the first line for the creditor account. In the field labeled Accounting Period, enter the accounting period to post to, for example December 2021. In the field labeled transaction date, enter the transaction date, for example the 9th of December 2021. In the field labeled account code, enter or browse for the account code to post to, for example 3311A01. In the field labeled VN description, enter the description for the transaction in Vietnamese, for example TT Zich Vu. In the field labeled EN description, Enter the description for the transaction in English, for example service payment. In the section for transaction amount, enter the transaction currency details including currency code and transaction amount. In this example, enter the currency as VND and the amount as 2 million. In the section for the base amount, accept the default values for the currency code and amount, they will be calculated automatically. In the option Debit or Credit, select Debit. In the fields Ledger Analysis 1 to 10, enter or browse for the analysis code as applicable. Click OK. Now, let's enter the details on the second line for the cash account. In the fields labeled Accounting Period and Transaction Date, accept the defaults from the previous lines. In the field labeled account code, enter or browse for the cash account code to post to, for example 1111001. In the fields labeled VN description and EN description, accept the defaults from the previous lines. In the section for transaction amount, enter the transaction currency details including currency code and transaction amount. In this example, Enter the currency as VND and the amount as 2 million. In the section for base amount, accept the default values for the currency code and amounts, they are calculated automatically. In the option debit or credit, select credit. In the fields ledger analysis 1 to 10, enter or browse for the analysis code if applicable. In this example, select the analysis employee, creditor, Data, IC code 3311A01. And select the analysis VAS cash flow, direct code 02. Click OK. 
Verify the transaction balance by checking if the value of out of balance buy is zero. As the journal is completed and ready for posting, cancel the extra new line, line 3, by selecting line 3 and clicking cancel. To post the journal, click post. If the post provisional is set up, depending on your organization's policy, the message do you wish to post provisional will be displayed. Click no to permanently post the journal. Details such as transaction date, accounting period, account, and amounts cannot be amended after a journal is hard posted. In this example, we'll post the journal provisionally, so click yes. On successful posting, the system will display the automatically generated journal number on the status bar. You have arrived at the end of the lesson. Have fun with your hands-on exercise.